Hello everyone, I'm Eric with Midas and thanks for joining me here at Music Group Studios. I've got a quick tip on the M32 today on how to utilize your DCAs. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so using a DCA on the M32, you can think of it as your VCA on your analog console. It's just a way to get multiple channels onto one fader. And that's a great thing to do when you don't want to mix on all 32 faders at one time. You can separate and put them onto groups and that way you can have your drums, all your vocals, all the bass and all the guitars all on separate faders and mix on one hand as opposed to two hands and on separate layers. So let's go ahead and do an example. I'm going to choose DCA1 to be all of my drums. So let's do that right now. I'm going to hit the select button on DCA1. Now I'm going to select all my drum channels. And now you can see signal here on DCA1. And now if I raise this fader, it's going to give all the signals uh, for all of my drum channels onto one fader going to the master bus. So let's go ahead and do all my vocals. I'll do DCA2 and select all my vocals. Now I have all my drums and all my vocal channels on separate faders. So all my vocals and all my drums. All right, so now that I've set up my DCA, I'm gonna go ahead and color code it on the scribble strip so I know what it's affecting. So I'm gonna go to DCA1, which I've used for my drums, and all my drum channels are red. So I'm gonna come over here and select DCA1, come over to my utility button right here next to the screen. And with this encoder right here, I'm gonna change the color to red. So now DCA1 with all my drum channels, is now the same color as all my drum channels. So now I know that when I adjust this level here, it's affecting all the channels that I have going into DCA1, which are all my drums and they're coded in red. Also, you might wanna know that whatever you have on a DCA, you can also mute all those channels at one given time with the push of one button too. Just mute the DCA. And as you can see, all of my drum channels here are blinking uh, on the mute button. That's just telling you that you have it muted on the DCA. And I could do the same thing with my vocals. As you can see, my three channels of vocals here are now blinking, again telling me that it's being muted from the DCA. So there you have it. It's just that easy to utilize the DCAs on your M32. I'm Eric with Midas. For more information, please be sure to visit MidasConsoles.com. Thanks for joining me here at Music Group Studios. I'll see you next time.